Tennessee end of course practice test question number four. Uh, I'm plugging in values for x here. I'm actually given values for x this time. So I'm not solving for anything. I'm just kind of uh, finding the value of the expression or simplifying. X, to the f or x is 4, so I do 4 squared over 2 plus x, which is 4, times y to the third power. The key to getting this part right is to make sure that your negative 2 is in a parentheses before you raise it to the third power. I don't know why I had raised that to the second power, but you want to raise it to the third power. It's important that you put the negative 2 inside the parentheses and don't just leave the parentheses out for a variety of reasons. Number one, because it's multiplying by 4. But the real reason is that if you were doing squared with uh, cubing it or to the third power, it doesn't really affect it as much, but when you square it, it is absolutely integral that you put the negative inside because your answer is going to give you a, a positive if you do it this way, because it would be negative 2 times negative 2. But if I didn't have the parentheses, it would say negative t or 2 to the third power, or in this case, to the third power, uh, times negative 1, which would give you a negative answer, which is fine here, but when you square it, it does matter. So as a matter of practice, just do it that way. Uh, 4 squared is 16 over 2. Uh, negative 2 to the third power is negative 8. So I do 16 divided by 2, which is 8, plus 4 times negative 8 is negative 32. And my final answer is going to be negative 24. Now, as a little bit of extra incentive to sort of uh, maybe you want to do it this way. If you have a calculator that do fractions, TI-84 plus, and I know does them, so does this TI-73 that I'm using. I always try to put the things touching each other in parentheses just to sort of remind the calculator that it is um, a multiply situation. Make sure you put that third outside the parentheses. Oh, sorry, I hit x squared. I wasn't even thinking. Don't be stupid like me and look at it and see x squared there. Remember that x is 4. I was wondering why that didn't work. It's because I'm a doofus. There you go, 4 squared divided by 2 plus parentheses before close it out negative 2 to the third power sorry about that a little weird now it looks like it's supposed to I'm gonna hit enter and I get negative 24 which is exactly the answer that I should get and it's the answer I got there so that's the answer to number four